Hi and welcome back to my channel for the love of organizing. I'm Laura and I share my tips on creating an inspired home and life you'll love with budget-friendly finds. Today's video is a collaboration hosted by Jamie of Board or Bananas and the theme is the look for less. I was inspired to create this look after I came across some designer liners for a fridge shelf on jane.com. Now everything I used was either purchased at the Dollar Tree, Walmart, or it was thrifted. And I'll include um, links to the products that I can find below, as well as a link to the playlist with all of the other channels that are participating. So let's go ahead and jump into the transformation. Here's a look at our refrigerator before the makeover. Now I try to stay in the routine of wiping the shelves down about once a week. And I have to say my least favorite part is removing the drawers and rinsing them out. So I was excited to um, take on this transformation and see if I could kind of make my system a little more efficient. You can tell I'm a mom who packs lunches, I'm sure, with all the juice, applesauce, and yogurt. This footage was taken the day before I went grocery shopping, so it's a little emptier than normal, but that made the transformation a little easier. Let me show you how I brought more life into the space. I started with some simple organizers, and by now you know how much we love turquoise. I wanted the inside of our refrigerator to reflect our taste and feel cohesive with the rest of the kitchen. This basket was from the Dollar Tree. I picked up some of these smaller bowls from Walmart, and then more Dollar Tree with these little crates as well. I went ahead and tried a few different configurations with the new organizers and I found that the bowls worked really well for the applesauce and the yogurts and the juices are now nice and tidy so it was time to work on the drawers. Now to bring things back to the original inspiration, the liners. I picked up these pretty damask placemats from the Dollar Tree. They wipe clean, it's super easy, and I knew they were wide enough to fit the shelf space really well. I went ahead and removed one of the shelves to serve as a template, uh, and with two of the mats taped together, I could tackle one of our shelves. I just traced and cut and repeated the process several times and look at how well the pattern and the turquoise work together. Moving on to the drawers, the same concept, tracing and trimming to get the right size. I'm really loving the way it's looking so far. And now to bring in the crates, which will be a great time saver. I can just remove and rinse these instead of the entire drawer. Of course, just wiping down if there are spills. I moved the eggs into a Temptations bowl for this video, honestly, but I'm on the lookout for an Anthropology egg crate in Aqua. Here is the final look. I'm going to purchase a few more of the placemats to customize the door shelves as well. Just FYI, I used 14 mats in this video. and the budget for everything was under $25. If you're new here or missed my last video, be sure to check out our Jacksonville, Florida flea market haul with some of our favorite vintage finds. I also have a host of organizing and DIY videos and I hope you'll stay a while. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed. I'd love to interact with you, so leave me a comment below. I'm also over on Snapchat as Love Organizing and on Instagram and Facebook. Please consider subscribing if you enjoyed, and I'll see you in my next video.